y'all. Uncle Michael here coming to you from Walton, Kentucky. J and I am headed to Ohio to make a pickup and then it's a beautiful day y'all and this is a big big place too there I go Mabel so I'm headed to Ohio do a pickup not supposed to be there until 5 30 this evening so y'all just to let you know uh i don't know i think things are slowing down i know we should be picking up but i just saw a video where socal trucker uh, go and subscribe if you want to learn more about trucking. SoCal Trucking said, read a list off all of all these companies that are shutting down, closing stores. Yeah. And you know, when you have all those stores closing down, well, you don't need a truck you don't need a truck to uh, bring you those products. So as these stores keep closing down, uh, there'll be less need for truck. But we're gonna see how this works, how this changes. Uh, I'm just out doing a little walk around, parking lot. It was jam packed last night, of course. And now everybody else is gone. And I have to wait until later on this afternoon. But I'm gonna try to get there a little early. Maybe, uh, maybe 3.30 instead of 5.30. See if they have anything. But I'm gonna make some more telephone calls and see if they'll just go ahead and let me come in now so all right y'all so what happened was yesterday i went and got delivered in ohio i was in ohio had to deliver some beef so after that i had to go and get a washout but all the washouts were closed by the time I got finished with my delivery. So I called dispatch and they moved my appointment time. And I was able to come down to Kentucky to get a thorough washout. A thorough washout at the Blue Beacon, which is right over there on the other side of those trees so i got the blue beacon and flying jay was right here so i said well let me just go ahead and park because i don't have to be there until 5 30 today so and they're doing some construction here at this uh flying J. yep so this is where i am this is where I I'm doing right now I only got 62 miles yesterday y'all that's it 62 miles on the truck so that's why it's always good to plan y'all plan stack your money save for a rainy day because I might have two rainy days coming but I'm still good still employed thankful for that 
So I was gonna walk all the way around, but I could go half and then turn around and go half. That'll work. All right, so what y'all been up to? Y'all, we got 925 subscribers. Ain't that something? That is outstanding. Ain't that something? Y'all just don't know what plans I have for y'all shortly. Within the next two or three months. But, uh, yeah, we got 925 subscribers, y'all. I sure appreciate y'all for that. Y'all keep sharing these videos and liking and commenting. That's great. There's Mr. UPS. Should be pulling that extra one. They use a tow too. So, after I pick up this load from Ohio, I will be heading down to Alabama, all the way down to the Gulf. And I have to be there on the 1st. So now I gotta think about the 4th of July and we'll see where they're gonna have me going going during that time frame but usually during holidays uh, the receivers aren't working the shippers aren't working shoot we got a lot of dispatchers not going to be working and uh, we're going to have to go somewhere and sit again so if they give me a load that I'll have to drive through the fourth. That'd be great. But more than likely than not, well, they're gonna do the best they can. But if not, then I'll just have to get as close as I can to the uh, receiver and park. And I'll just have to park and wait until they open up and go on in and deliver the product. So, hope y'all are enjoying your day, enjoying your week. It's about to be the weekend, and not much for me to do other than to drive if I can get, get going. I, I just went into uh, Flying J. I was gonna get some coffee or maybe a sandwich and it looked like they had two buses show up. So I came on out of there. I said, let me let y'all know what I'm doing, where I am. I am safe. I am healthy. I am blessed. So I am good. Oh, that's a nice little walk there, y'all. There's Mabel right there. There she is. There she is. So I wonder what's on the other side of this fence. I don't see any traffic. It's like a holding ditch. There's some hay bales over there. Do it like this. Don't know if that helped out, but we'll see. All right, y'all. Take care of yourselves and each other. Love on yourselves and each other. I will get back to you 
on another video. Let you know where I am, what I'm doing. But I thank y'all very much for all the subscribers. And I thank y'all for all the comments. The comments are getting better and better. Uh, y'all are even commenting on each other's comments, which is good to have that conversation going, whatever the topic is. But let's just keep it polite, respectful. I understand we don't all have to agree on the same thing, but we can always agree to disagree. So, with that being said, y'all take care of yourselves and each other. Love on yourselves and each other. I know I keep saying this over and over again, but I mean it. And listen, I love y'all, and there ain't a thing you can do about it. All right? Appreciate you.